Hello everybody and welcome to episode number 11, I think, here on the channel of Cosmic Sky. How is everyone doing today? I am doing freaking fantastic, guys. Welcome back to a brand new episode today. If you're excited for this episode right here, make sure you smash a big like on this episode, okay? If we could hit 100 likes within 12 hours. 12 hours. That's the goal I'm setting, you guys. 12 hours this time. If we could smash that out, that would be absolutely awesome. I know you guys can smash that because you do every single time. Now, guys, today we are going to be doing something a little bit different. I haven't really done too much enchanting slash uh, mob grinding in this series, so I thought today we are going to do that. We are we are going to work up to what is essentially going to be how we get our, like, OP armor, because if you guys think about it, we need these gems for enchanting our armor with anything that's custom, and to be honest, half of the custom enchants are very, very OP, so so pretty much if we ever want to have anything that's considered a god set as such, we are going to need some of those enchants. That is essentially what we're going to be doing today. Uh, I do also have this little thing right here, which is called a rank kit 5, level 8, by the way. Um, You may look at my XP, by the way, as well. We currently have 89,000 levels of XP. Now, not levels, but 89,000 XP. That is basically from a bunch of my viewers. They came in really, really clutch, gifted me a bunch of it, because today we are going to be focusing, like I say, on the enchanting side of things, and hopefully, we're actually going to be going for Inquisitive, which increases is XP when you kill a mob. So, for example, if I were to chuck Inquisitive on this, which obviously we can't we can't do it on this sword. But if we were to chuck, if if we had Inquisitive on this sword, it would essentially go ham when we when we mine mobs. Uh, mo not mine mobs. When we kill mobs, it would give us so much XP. Phoenix, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime subscription right there. But yeah, that's essentially what we're going to be doing today is working on our custom enchants. So we're going to see if we even managed it. We, we probably, okay, the, the highest chance is that we are not going to get Inquisitive today. Any form of it, because it is an extremely rare enchant. It sells for a lot of money on its own. So, you know, we, we, we've got a lot we've got a lot to do. Now, we've just hit over 90k XP, so that's pretty cool. We're going to open our rank here right here, see what we managed to get. We got ourselves, oh my goodness, we got an iron pick. That's pretty cool. Um, We've got ourselves two spider spawners right there for the grinder. Stone Axe, an uh, Iron Repair Scroll, 50%, not bad, Stone Axe, a Mystery Iron Gem, an Iron Gem with Overload on it, we got 181k, and just a regular, it's a good Iron Pickaxe, you know, Efficiency efficiency 1, I thought it was going to be pretty cool, but, you know, it's it's high, it's high, we, we did get an Iron Pickaxe though, and I think that is the first Iron Pickaxe I think I've actually ever had, so, um, yeah, that's, that's, that's kind of cool. So, now, on to the main thing, guys, now, this is going to be where it comes in a little bit interesting, because we are going to be doing it with our Stone Gear, simply for the fact that it costs so, so so much XP to, to get the gems for um for iron that it's just not worth us doing it right now. So maybe that's something we'll work on in the future. But obviously, if we have Inquisitive now, then it means we're gonna get XP a lot easier to do it in the future. So that's that that's that's kind of the plan. You know, we're building for the better of our future, okay? Alright, so if we do slash uh enchanting right here, you guys it's not even enchanting, is it? It's enchanter. Uh boom. Enchanter. There we go. We can see that these are all the things we need to get right now. Now, these are just regular enchants, okay? These have got nothing to do with these, uh, with these mystery, uh, like, mystery gems or anything like that. So, if we were, for example, looking for a new sword and we wanted to get sharpness, then this is where we go for that. Obviously, these books cost XP. However, if we go into... I actually don't know what the command is for it. Um, I th Is it, like... Okay, it's slash gem. There we go. Uh, so this is a gem forge right here. You can use this to apply your enchants. You can use it to examine them, which is what we're actually going to be doing today. So if we go into our PV, I believe it's two. We actually have a bunch of mystery stone gems right here that need to be examined. So that's what we're going to be doing today is examining these five. Hopefully, we're going to get something cool from it. We'll have to see, but the chances are we're not going to. Um, but yeah, that's 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 basically what we're going to be doing today. So let's examine. They do cost a little bit to examine, so we're going to have to see. Uh, please place one at a time. Okay, we're going to have to spread these out in our inventory before we do that, so that's something to note. Uh, slash gem. Let's go into here. Boom. How much is this going to cost us XP? So it's a 1,000 XP to discover them, so let's see. Um, yeah, is, we're going to see what we get today. Let's confirm our first ever examined uh, this is literally the first time we've ever examined a stone gem. So let's see what we get. Three, two, one, boom. We got haste too. Now, I'm just saying, but I'm pretty sure that's a pretty good enchantment. Unfortunately, it is a 75% break chance. But if we were actually to, uh, like, unlock that, I'm pretty sure that's a decent enchantment right there. I'm not gonna lie. I, th I think I think that's a pretty big GG. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, not bad for our first ever one, right? Not bad. Let's discover the rest of the ones that we have right now and uh, see what we managed to get. So that is gonna give us Deathbringer 3. Not bad. We will take that. We're getting some decently high level enchants right now. Um, So I'm guessing the color that they are like determines their rarity. So I think that's probably a pretty good one uh, based on the fact that it's gold. Um, So yeah, that's not bad right there. Apparently that's a GG. We'll take that. But it is again a 75% 
percent break chance. I'm pretty sure that is standard by the looks of it. I I, I think it's a I think that's the standard. So apparently this is one of the best PvP enchants in the game though. So we will uh we will take that. We'll, we'll definitely take that. All right, next one. Here we go. Three, two, one. Boom. Boss layer one. Okay, we got we got our first poop one. I I think it's poop anyway. It doesn't it doesn't seem like it's particularly special. All right, next one. What did we get? We got icy veins one. Now I believe this was a new enchant that was brought in um a while back. Um, or not a while back, but literally in this past update, I think. I don't actually know what this one does. We're going to have to have a look. Chance to cause slowness to your attacker. Okay, so it's literally like a, a negative enchant. Cool. Not bad. All right, let's see what we've got in our last one that we have available right here. Three, two, one. Boom. Boss layer two. Okay, cool. So we've got two of those uh, dealing increased damage to elite and boss mobs, which is obviously going to come in useful if we or if or when we have to take on the elite bandit because yeah that's that, that's just gonna help us with that hopefully um so that's all everything that we got from our mysteries right there obviously we're not gonna uncover the mystery irons because we don't really have a reason to do that right now so we're gonna go into pv2 we're gonna chuck the mystery irons in here so that wasn't too bad right there um one of the other things that we're gonna be doing today though is we are going to uh actually be adding some more spiders to our grinder because i want to make this like as efficient as i possibly can here and uh yeah that's that's kind of what we're doing now i did of course just get some from our rank kit so we've got a few to add right here um so that's not too bad. Let's go ahead and mine this off real quick. Dope. All right, so we've got a couple more of these beautiful spider spawns to add to our spawner. That's also what we're going to be doing in part of today's episode is making sure that this is kept up to date and is spawning a lot of mobs because basically the more that those spawn, the more that XP we're going to be able to get, etc, etc. You know, it's going to work its way out. One of the things which I just quickly want to check, I don't know if there is any on AH, but I want to see what inquisitive enchants might be on the AH right now because I very, very much doubt that there is any on there based on their rarity and such. Like, people will be going after those right now. So, we're going to see if there is any. And if there is, then GG. If there's not, then rip. I guess we'll never know a price. So, with that being said, is there... Oh, there is Inquisitive 4 for 6.5 mil. Dude, imagine... Just imagine. Imagine getting that. 6. Oh, dude, that's a, that's a yikes. All right, let's see. Is there any other ones on here right now that will give us, like, a base price for... What we're looking at right here. Um, all right. Well, I guess we don't know. Um, we yeah, six point five mil, but a seventy five percent break chance. Exactly. Like it's a yikes. Apparently, there's a level one and a level two, and it's terminal, dude. That is a mega mega yikes right there. So it is very very expensive to buy, which is hence why the fact we're trying to unlock them right here. So we've got seven more of these mystery gems to open. So we're gonna have to get some serious luck right here. Basically, we need to open all these, reveal them, and see how we do. So let's do. Oh, if I could spell slash gem in the chat, and let's see what we managed to get from these. Now this is of course uh, like destroying my uh, destroying my XP right here, but it's all right. You know, technically, if we managed to, if we actually managed to pick this, the enchant that we're looking for, we'd have to get one super super lucky um what did we find last stand one yikes um we'd have to get super super lucky but if we did then you know we'll we'll have to see we'll have to see fatigue three that's not bad uh what we got well fed two come on death bring a one that's not good <laughs> shockwave three come on man Hit us up. Execute three. I, I, I see you. I see you. So we're literally going to have to buy as many of these that we can right now. So from the AH, the, these are literally the only way that we can get these right now. You can get them apparently from a bunch of different enchants. You can get them from adventures, of course. But you know you know how we do it out here. We literally just come in here and we buy as many as we can out there. Aiden, thank you so much for listing that up for 75k. That's much appreciated. We're, we're probably the only one that's interested in buying these right now. I'm not going to lie because we like a little bit of a gamble over here. And uh, I'm, I'm just trying to... I'm out here trying to get myself a uh, inquisitive enchant now obviously it's gonna be very very hard but um yeah it's just, it's gonna be very very hard but we on the grind and that's part of this grind you know that's why we did a little bit uh, at the start of the stream you guys won't know this on youtube but at the start of the stream we did a little bit of money grinding because i knew that we were probably gonna have to end up buying these so yeah we we, we know what the grind's about we're just gonna make the money to keep on funding the purchases of these and one day okay one day and i don't i don't know whether i should say this or not but i promise you I will get some form of inquisitive from one of these gems right here. That's a promise, all right, guys. I I don't break promises here. It's not what we do. <laughs> so yeah, we'll have we'll have to see. Okay, so we got another five to do right here. Let's go ahead and see what we've got. Um, if I could even remember the command, it's slash gem. There we go. Oh wait, we need to split them up again. I always forget to split them up, dude. Always forget to split them up. All right, here we go. Let's go examine. Come on, wish me luck. Let's go. Fatigue three. Yikes. Uh, come on. Boss layer two. That's yikes. Gem Finder 2, that is probably good. Um, increase the chance to discover a mystery enchant gem when manually mining resource nodes. 
That is something which I want to chuck onto this pickaxe. That seems like it could be a good enchant right there. Um, if, if it, you know, if it works, then that's probably a GG. Well fed two and berserk three. Okay, not bad. So if we actually manage to get this, um, I'm pretty sure that'll be insane. So, should we try it? Should we try and add this to our pickaxe right here? I know this isn't obviously what we're going for, but should we try it right here? I think I'm going to try it. I think we're going to do it. I, th I think we're just going to have to try it right here. So, it is gem finder 2 um, onto this pickaxe. And if it works... Oh, wait. We don't have any sockets, lol. We need a pickaxe with sockets. I'm stupid. Um, let's get a pickaxe with sockets then. Um, and then, if that works, that's going to be a GG. Okay, so we're going to buy this pickaxe right here. Boom. Um, basically, this is a socket with, with the, that's empty on this pickaxe. It's got one socket, so we can only put one thing on it. I believe that's what that means. Um, and it also came with efficiency 4, so that's not bad. We'll take that. Um, so, what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to attempt this enchant right here. If this works, then this is going to be a big, big GG. If it doesn't work, then it's all right, you know, it's not the end of the world. We may as well try it since it could potentially lead to us getting a lot of gems right here. So we're going to give this a go right here. Let's see what happens. Without further ado, let's do it right here. So it is slash, uh, what is, what is the command? Slash gem. Let's do it right here. We're going to pop into this. We're going to go into this big axe right here and wish me luck. I need some, I need some serious good luck wishes in the chat right here to try and get this gem finder too. If we genuinely get this, then this is going to be insane, and this pickaxe will be the freaking godly pickaxe, all right? Guys, wish me luck right now in the chat. We got 25% chance of getting this. It's so, so low, but you know what? It might happen. It might not. 25%, it's a yikes, but we need some bless ups right now. Three, two, one, prepared to be disappointed. Yikes. <laughs> yikes. Um... Your stone jam finder shatters when you attempt to force it into the socket. It's alright though. It's alright. It was it was never gonna like let's be honest, there was always a lower chance that it would do that. So it's all good. It's uh it's not too bad. At least it doesn't like the the one thing I like about this is it doesn't like destroy the item you try and put it on. So, you know, I'm I'm glad that I at least keep the pickaxe because I'm sure we'll get an enchant very, very soon that we'll be able to use onto that. So we technically just got given two inquisitive one enchants, okay? Now obviously you can't like you can't combine those, we can't do anything like that. Um but I've think that these because they're permanent sockets we can't remove them i'm pretty sure that's what that means so basically we're gonna have to buy ourselves a new sword um is is what's gonna happen so yeah we we, we we only have 600k in the balance though so we're gonna have to be a little bit careful we just need to buy one of these swords right here um which oh my goodness some of these are op um basically we just need to buy an empty socketed sword which this one will do it's 225k right here but we'll take it as a bandit stone sword we're gonna try our luck with some inquisitive right now see what happens see if we manage to do it to them we'll see what freaking happens right here so slash gem guys wish me luck in the chat right here we're gonna try and apply inquisitive one to this bad boy let's see if it comes out what's this one a 56 percent break chance so we have pretty much even chances on this one guys i'm imagining that this will probably work but it's gonna cost me 2.5 kxp to find out so bless ups right now three two one we did it we did it we've we, we freaking did it, dudes. We officially have Inquisitive 1 on our sword. Now, I don't know what the rate of, like, XP is. Like, like I don't, know, I don't know what the addition of XP is that we get from Inquisitive 1. I'm assuming it's not really, like, OP. So, you know, we, but at least, we, at least we have it now. At least we have it. You watch this. I'm now going to... I'm now going to make this freaking uh, mystery stone gem, and it's gonna it's gonna give me Inquisitive 3 now. That I've just bought that sword, dude. Can you imagine Cleave 5 though? What the heck is Cleave? What the heck is Cleave? Damage your players within an increasing radius depending on the enchantment level. That sounds like a pretty OP enchantment if you ask me. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna chuck Sharpness three and Bane of Arthropods four in it because that should be enough to uh, get it going right here. So let's find the cheapest Bane of Arthropods four, uh, which would be this one right here, 50k. Um, let's go ahead and buy that and let's chuck this on. So slash anvil real quick. Uh, that on there, boom, sharpness, perfect. That on there, that on there, perfect. All right, so this will be our grinding sword for the second. Let's go back up to our spiders and see how effective, see how effective this actually is, like the inquisitive. I mean, you know, we probably at this level aren't, yeah, there we go, it's one shot in the spiders, GG. Probably at this level, I'm gonna notice it too much, but it's definitely gonna come in, uh, definitely gonna come in handy. So let's get ourselves up to an even amount of XP quickly. Let's get ourselves up to an even amount of XP. All right, that'll do, that'll do. Here we go. Uh, one, two. Three, four, five. So we're on 45. Now, let it just add up real quick. So it was on uh, four, four, uh, 455. Or was it on four? It was on 445. 
So that gave us 45 XP, right? Right? Yeah. That gave us 45 XP. That was without Inquisitive. So now let's see what we get with this. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, there we go. That, that, mm. <laughs> oh, dude. Oh, dude. 47. 47, dude. 45 versus 47. In conclusion, do not buy this book for any more than 1k. <laughs> because honestly, it's not going to make a difference. Like, it's, it's genuinely not going to make that much of a difference that's, that's even going to make it noticeable. So, um, yeah. You, you, might, you might get an extra 2 XP, which is I. It is I, right, but you know, it, it definitely ain't, uh, definitely ain't, um, ain't OP, let's put it that way. I imagine once you get an Inquisitive 3, you're looking at good numbers, but. <sighs> Yikes on that one, dude. So there we have it, guys. That is where I'm going to end off this video. We have done a little bit of experimenting today. We've indeed got our first Inquisitive Sword, so that's pretty GG. We spent a lot of money trying to do it, though. I'm not going to lie. Like, we, we genuinely have spent a lot of money. Um, I do just want to give a quick stop and shout out to every single person that are on these boards because these are the people that supported my uh, streams over the last couple of uh, streams right here, either donating bits or donating money or whatever. And a special shout out to everybody on here. I also want to give a, a very, very special shout out to the people that were the top three bit donators of last week because they've helped me out so so much and that is to spade whopper brandon heathcott and lizzie the lizard thank you so much to you three especially guys thank you so much for tuning into today's episode if you have enjoyed it you want to do it right now smash that like button it would be much appreciated you guys know how it go how, how, how it gee how it be we want to hit that 100 likes in 12 hours guys thank you so much for tuning in today's episode and i shall see you in the next episode of skyblock on cosmic sky